Oh, it's been terrible. It's been an absolute nightmare. One hand doesn't know what the other's doing. Stuck in a place like this, it's barely wheelchair accessible, like actually dangerous. A lot of families here with seven, eight kids. And imagine wearing the same clothes for four to five days already. And some of, us, some of them have been wearing their same clothes for one week. Yes, we got issued checks and everything else, but after, the, after getting those checks, uh, the banks were holding them for four to five days. Here we thought, okay, an evacuation, the Canadian Red Cross is going to be there. It's going to greet people. We're going to have interpreters. We're going to have people, you know, with language barriers, with cultural barriers, with, with mobility issues, like, you know, with barriers, that they're all going to be accommodated. They're all going to be dealt with. We're going to be treated like human beings. But no, we are shuffled in like a herd of cattle and shuffled back out onto the pasture to fend for ourselves.